Triple E EDC back again with another night video. So we're going to do an unboxing today. Kind of unorthodox for the channel. I used to do them. I went away with them uh, because I didn't think a lot of people love them. If you do like them, comment below. I, I may be doing more. Um, but we're doing one today because uh, Dan Gavrilovsky, who is a longtime subscriber on the channel and also a very active participant in a lot of the live streams around the knife community, uh, he let me know about the S45 uh, VN Spyderco mules when they came out, and he uh, does handling. He, he makes knife handles. So uh, I wanted to go ahead and get my Spyderco mule uh, handle done, and so I went ahead and actually sent this over to him. He's over in Europe, and uh, so I had to ship the Spyderco mule over to Europe, and he went ahead and, and made that for me, and he's going to be uh, sending it back to me here. So, or he had, he went ahead and sent it back to me here. So that's what I've got here. So we already know it's going to be an S45VN, but what uh, I don't know, I saw some pictures, but you know, it, it, seeing these things in person is usually different. Uh, I'm very curious to see what it's going to end up being. I did sort of cut off some of the uh, identifying information that was on here. So, um, you know, we've got all the, all the identifying information was cut off on here, but this was uh, very, very well taped from, uh, from Europe here. So let's go ahead and uh, do an unboxing. Uh, this is a uh, K390 Endora, by the way, uh, with micarta scales, micarta backspacer. Um, so let's go ahead and do this. All right, I think I've got this. He also told me he was including a couple of extras in here. Curious to see exactly what. So let me make sure there's no uh, notes or anything. Nope, I don't see any notes. Okay, so um, here is, let's put the knife to the side for a second. Uh, so he, I think he included a bunch of stuff for my kids, um, which is pretty cool. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much, Dane. This is really cool. My kids are gonna love this. Um, so a couple of Looney Tunes characters. Uh, and uh, SpongeBob, very very cool. All right, let's let's go ahead and uh, and get to the actual knife. He did go ahead and make the leather sheath sheath for this. So um, you know this uh, has very nice thread. Actually, the stitching on here is is very good. I'm very impressed by the stitching, Dane. Uh, so yeah, and the leather smells really good. Um, yeah, the leather smells awesome here. Uh, very very cool. So he does he works with a lot of stabilized woods. Let's go ahead and take a look at this uh, how it turned out. So this is the Spyderco Mule in uh, CPM S45VN. Uh, and this, like I said, is that stabilized wood. Look at that, it's absolutely beautiful. I mean this, and it's, it, it's nice and smooth, but also has sort of that, that wood texture uh, that you'd expect. Um, you know, it, this, is, uh, this is a beautiful, beautiful knife. Uh, feels really good in hand. Uh, obviously the shape is, is done by Spyderco. Uh, because that's how the tang was shaped. But um, as far as uh, you know, the curvature of, every, of of everything on the handles, this is this feels great in hand. It is absolutely gorgeous, Dane. I'm uh, I'm very very impressed with this. So I've got a couple of uh, other knives being custom made, uh, fixed blades being custom made by someone uh, Dane recommended to me. I'm gonna have uh, those sent to him when uh, when they're done being forged and uh, he's gonna do a couple more handles for me. Uh, and now I'm really excited for those because this is absolutely awesome. Um, I, I wasn't expecting this to have sort of uh, the qualities that it does. So if you look closely, uh, if you guys know what tiger, Tiger's Eye is as far as like a gem, um, so that's really what I'm getting out of this. It has sort of that, that Tiger's Eye characteristic with these beautiful wood tones that sort of remind me of the um, box box elder that uh, Chris Reeve does. Um, so I don't know if that's actually what it is. I don't know what kind of wood this is exactly. Uh, Dane, if you know, comment below. Um, but that's what it reminds me of is that sort of box elder with some tiger eye mixed in. This is just absolutely beautiful. Um, this is great job, uh, Dane. I, I love this. I'm really looking forward to using it. Um, this, is, this is awesome. Uh, and really I'm very impressed by the leather sheath here. Uh, it, it, it just feels great. Um, you can see here, uh, it's good quality leather, uh, smells great, and has great stitching. You really can't ask for a whole lot more. Um, so, uh, a little quick unboxing. Thanks so much, Dane, uh, for this. I really appreciate it. It is, um, this is definitely going to be a keeper for me, uh, and I really appreciate your hard work. Thanks so much.